Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle and um, today um, it's uh, been warmer than yesterday and um, it's also been sunny also if you have a look outside the window and um, yes, it's been a really nice day um, today um, in the morning, um, I went over to Loughborough, um, which is a town, a large town in Leicestershire, nine miles away. And uh, guess what? I brought a new mobile phone. So um, hopefully, uh, fingers crossed, um, just pl playing with it seems absolutely way better than the other one. So... I'm just hoping to get some um, money uh, tomorrow for my old mobile phone, um, if I can, that is. Um, again, keeping my fingers crossed. And uh, yes, um, again, it seems up to now a, a really great um and faster mobile phone which i'm really pleased about the camera looks better as well and um the video recording it just seems a lot more brighter anyway um today i'm going to be doing uh, luxury travel five exciting facts january 2022 at part four Again, hi if you're new to my channel, my name's Rebecca and I love talking about travel and lifestyle. Please subscribe uh, for more uh, content. Um, it's free to subscribe um, on both my travel and lifestyle channel. Um, I'd be really grateful and thank you very much. So I am going to uh, jump right into the luxury travel facts uh, kicking it off uh, with number one which is at ttgmedia.com slash luxury luxury travelers and um, driving conscious uh, travel trends um, luxury travelers are keener th uh, than ever to support the uh, re responsible tourism agenda uh, favouring travel brands and hotels that show awareness of su sustainable travel issues which is really good and it is uh, really important in my opinion as well uh, moving on to number two luxury travel advisor.com uh, discover the Palladium Hotel Group's uh, new flights and hotel packages in Ibiza, Madrid, Epog, uh, Sicily and Menorca. There's lots of places, um, or at least quite a few places on the list, and they look absolutely fantastic. And these are a group of four and five star hotel for luxury travellers. Number three, Travel Weekly, elegant resorts uh, see significant changes in travel habits. The pandemic has led to a significant changes to affluent uh, customers' lifestyles and travel plans. Um, according to the luxury uh, trends report from Elegant Resorts, Elegant Resorts average booking value uh, so far for 2022 has increased by 46%. So that's really good news compared with 2019's. While the average number of passengers per booking has risen by 10% and the duration of their stays on average is 25% longer wow than ever before maybe it's uh, because a lot of people haven't uh, been able to uh, travel obviously in the past uh, with the pandemic and more are doing it because more places are opening up again that uh, that's 
what I think anyway. And number four, luxurytravelmagazine.com. Love is in the air at Hawaii's or Hawaii Maldives. It's a luxury yacht experience on board at the Bella, I guess. Um, can spend a day snorkeling or on uh, some of the time and um looking at obviously the reefs at lang we i do whole shark and manta ray um searching uh, with a, a in-house marine biologist wow that sounds really exciting also on the island, the re resort has um, a cocoa bar, spa, champagne pavilions, um, float champagne at breakfast, escape to a deserted uh, sandbanks, also a undersea restaurant. Wow, that, uh, that is absolutely amazing. Long Waii Island Resort is in the Maltese for adults only paradise getaway and it's great for weddings, honeymoons, um, much needed spontaneous breaks or say Valentine's Day. So even if you're not celebrating a special occasion you can still go there. Uh, last but not least, number five, LuxuryTravelMagazine.com, Color de, Dio Venice's at newest five-star hotel, recognised for its commitment to sustainability. It's open last year in 2021 and a member of the V Retreat Group of Hotels is now part of the Con collection of small luxury hotels of the world recognised of a commitment to sustainability and social impact measures and um, it looks really impressive all these hotels look really uh, impressive and if you do want to spe spend uh, more out on them or it is for a special occasion or a once in a lifetime experience and again you might, it might as well go for it um, obviously if you've got the budget so i would like to say thank you for what uh, for watching and um, again if you obviously haven't got uh, the budget for that uh, tomorrow i'm going to be doing a budget travel uh, special um and to uh, obviously give budget travel advice um five uh, fantastic facts and that's going to be tomorrow so i would like to say thank you for watching and bye for now and i hope you all have a good day and night wherever you are in the world thank you bye